What's poppin' my air signs? This is your uh, monthly air signs February reading. I have already set with my team. I am the voice of the voices. Talk to me, spirit. Let's give them something to talk about. Let's see what the fuck is going on in the month of February. What's up, my Libras? First card out, my Libras. I ain't playing with you. Practice freedom. Spirit saying, release the weight of judgment. Okay? Libras, February, you're going to have to watch your mouth. You're going to have to watch the words that's coming out of your mouth because you're being judged. You're under judgment. For a reason what I'm saying, you are getting ready to start your life purpose. When you get ready to start your life purpose, you can't be dwelling. You can't be that shit starter. Libras, y'all like to start a lot of shit. Y'all like to keep things messy. And then y'all be in the middle smiling. Well, you know what? Karma's a bitch because this is the year of four. This is the year of karma. So Spirit is saying even my uh, music went off of the water. So this is your year. Practice freedom. Practice what you speak. Because be careful what you say. Be careful what you put on another person because it's going to retaliate back. Uh, some of these are my low vibrational Libras. Every Libra is not low vibrational. Now, my higher uh, level uh, Libras, y'all get ready to score like that falcon, that eagle, like that uh, hulk. Your vision is about to change. You're getting ready to get that freedom. 26, break down to 8. You could be a life path number 8, my uh, uh, Libras, okay? Or you could be born... Uh, or know somebody that's born on the 26th, okay? So, this is what I'm saying. So, my low vibration believers, y'all need to stop. You know, because y'all messy. Okay? That was for my low vibrational. But my higher vibrational, there's a change coming. They want you to continue to release judgment. Only God can judge, okay? Direction. You have the card of direction. Your purpose is unfolding slowly, step by step. As you go along, there's no need to hurry or worry. You're being divinely guided. That's why I'm saying they say release the weight of judgment, my high vibrationals. And my lower vibrationals, y'all got to stop with the messy shit. Y'all got to stop with the messy shit, all right, in the month of February. What else does my Libras need to know in the month of February, spirit? Dagger. Fear, worries, tense situation. Release the weight of judgment. So my low vibrations, when you throw a dagger in somebody's back and cause a lot of messiness, it's going to retaliate back on you and you're not going to like it because it's going to be triple. Okay? And for my high vibrational levers in the month of February, let go. Even though they stabbed you in the back, let go. Your blessings are are very big they're being moved around okay something happened to y'all in november okay spirit is saying whatever happened in november y'all need to release that shit release the weight of judgment if it's someone that did you wrong in the month of november that stabbed you in the back let it go okay and spirit is saying for my low vibrational libras whatever mess shit show you started you are getting ready to face that karma in the month of February. Okay, a lot of y'all Libras, y'all psychic ability is heightening up. Trust your intuition. For some of y'all, um, it's opening up more. All right? Y'all going to start seeing more. First card out for my Libras, causing you to miss out a loss of an opportunity. This is what Spirit is saying. Y'all are going through a transformation. Something that happened to you. Okay, for some of my Libras, some dirt was done on you, stabbed you in the back, causing you to miss out on, uh, and lose an the opportunity. They are getting ready to get their karma. And for my low vibrational, whoever you cause this person to, and you fuck with them back in November, you are getting ready to face the wrath of God in the month of February. All right? So you need to change that now. I'm hearing a lot of forgiveness. Forgiveness of others, forgiveness for yourself, okay? Libras, okay? Surrender is the card that came out to you. Sometimes learning to surrender can feel as if you're dying. The ego learns what's hardest to stop trying to control the whole universe. You want to be free. You got to let go. You cannot control everything. 
let the uh, universe balance things out. Step into your inner power. Give me the courage and the power to do what we must do. This is practicing freedom. This is practicing letting go and let God. This is practicing what you preach. Okay? Everything has a cause and effect. Okay? So my lower vibrational Libras that like to start shit, you need to stop because you're not going to like it. And then for my higher vibrational, y'all breaking free. Okay? Everything is working in your divine good. What else for my Libras? 1010. It's up to you. Practice freedom. Release the weight of judgment. Okay? Practice flow, patience, clarity, joy, movement, self-realization, taking action, unconditional love. That's given to you and given to others. It's time to push those long-cherished ideas into action. You will soon come to come in contact with the appropriate individuals, circumstances, and resources. Eventually, you will experience joy as well as brand new opportunities. Trust in the progress. All right? You're going in a totally different direction. All right? All right, spirit. Pay attention to the signs. I'm here in Libra. Okay? The signs from different people, from spirits. From people that you ghosted, cut off. They could be still contacting you under uh, false princesses under another profile. Okay, someone that y'all used to date have been seeing so many signs and synchronicities that reminds me of you. It made me feel certain that you are the one for me and we have a brighter future. I just have to figure out how to follow them. I am gaining strength and courage for that. Okay. You could be missing someone and someone could be missing you. All right. Let's get into the tarot for my Libra. The high priestess, you're stepping into your higher purpose, your higher uh, calling. This is why you need to practice letting go. You have to be in balance. When you out of balance, you're off. Okay? When in doubt, when your first gut feeling can always be trusted. You are stepping into the union. You got to remember your Libra. Libra in Spanish means free. So you have to be with the yin and the yang. The light and the dark. Okay? You have to constantly keep your vibration on point, on level. All right? But a lot of y'all are going through a change. All right? Things are getting done for you. I release you, my Libras. All right. What's popping? My Geminis. Okay. This is your reading for the month of February, my Geminis. All right. Let's see what the fuck is going on for my Geminis. It is 818 timestamp. All right. For my Geminis. Gemini's, Ooh, they got a lot to say. Your emotions are everywhere. You're battling with your dark self. You're battling with your light self. You keep running from your calling. You keep running from your shadow work, all right? You could be, 12 could be significant. 12 breaks down to three. Three could be a life path number for you. A lot of change, a lot of communication, the Holy Trinity. Look for the deeper meaning. Spirit is saying you're moving too quick. Like I said, you're running. You're running. You have the spirit of Jonah. Okay, so you about, have you ever been swallowed? You're about to be swallowed up, Gemini. Okay, because you're running from your calling. So God is about to have you be swallowed by the whale. You have the spirit of Jonah around you. So a lot of y'all are going to slow down and y'all ain't going to have a choice but to sit and sit with thyself. Well, you have to. So sit with both of y'all. Let love guide you. Spirit is saying you have to let God love guide you. You have to, you emotional wreck. You everywhere. So you have to 
let your conscience be your guide, which is your Ori, which is your higher self. Okay, choose to see the good in the world today. Okay, 24 breaks down to five. Y'all going through a drastic change. Okay, y'all could be in on your job for 24 years. You can have a 24-year-old. You can be 24. It's time to celebrate you. Stop running from you. Okay, two. A lot of y'all is two, two, two. A lot of unions coming in. You and spirit. You and your higher self. You as a Gemini. The yin and the yang becoming one. Y'all not fighting with one another. Cultivate an air of celebration today. Ain't that funny? They said cultivate an air of celebration because you are air. All right? You are air, Gemini. So it's like y'all stepping into a union. Y'all stepping into balance in the month of February. You about to be swallowed. All right? Let's see, Gemini. What else? gestures you may be asked to help someone out or you may need a need a hand give deserve praise to others and you will receive recognition too like i said do unto others you want others to do unto you okay spirit is saying you got to stop running okay because spirit is going to send somebody in there that's going to attack you and i'm not talking about a bad way but i'm hearing this is your time you are going to be spiritual attack God would turn everybody against you so you don't have a choice but to listen. Like I said, y'all going to be in the uh, belly of the well of Jonah. Y'all have that Jonah spirit on you, uh, Geminis. A lot of y'all, y'all do got good news coming. And a lot of y'all, y'all going to start hearing more extra. Y'all, clear audience is opening up more. But y'all do got good uh, news coming. Okay, there's going to be a period of frustration. Lessons to be learned. That's what I'm saying. You're about to be swallowed okay in the month of february because you keep running from your calling all right let's see for my gemini's in the month of february spirit what do they need to know all right a lot of y'all that's being swallowed y'all gonna have to practice forgiveness okay sometimes you hurt people unintentionally Sometimes you get hidden motives of malice in your heart. And sometimes, you know what? You don't even, like I said, you don't. They don't realize that they are sending you the evil eye with words and actions. Sometimes you don't realize you're doing that to yourself. Sometimes you don't realize you're doing that to other people. And then other people are coming to you. So I'm here practicing forgiveness. Forgiveness of others and forgiveness of yourself. Okay? You're going to have time to reflect. Like I said, you're going to have no choice but to sit with you. A lot of things are going to be happening, causing you dizzy spells, blur, vision, nosebleeds, loss of healing, hearing, okay? Some people is trying to block. They are uh, doing work on you and telling uh, block the spirit so you cannot hit the message, okay? And spirit is trying to tell you this, but like I said, you everywhere, you keep running, so you're about to be swallowed, all right, Gemini's, in the month of February. All right. Zero to 20. Act, act on your idea. Realistic and practical approach. Goals, divine timing, ambition, corporation, and discipline. Yep, you're about to. You have the benefit of good fortune. And if you use your wise judgment, you can do anything. In this place, you can reach new heights. You should act on your potential when you see this pattern. Since what your plant will grow, you're about to experience a spectacular uh, accent. A lot of y'all seeing 1122, great shift. Because you're about to be swallowed. Personal growth, spiritual development, and manifesting goals. One is connection and completion. First, focus on the positive change occurring due to your efforts. Then expand your horizons or permit yourself to try something new. So many positive shifts are in store for you. The world around you is changing in favor of your intentions. All right. What else does my Gemini's need to know? Divine love. They want you to practice divine love because of karma. Every cause is an effect. When you offer everything to the divine with attachment, you become love. You begin a love affair with the spirit. There's nothing from a past life that can't be addressed in its current life. 
your intuition is going to be heightened up and your clear audience is about to be heightened up. Each person's road to the inner Lord is extraordinary and personal. How liberating to listen inside and sense moment to moment what's needed. You are receiving blessings once you sit down. So God is going to swallow you up because you have the spirit of Jonah in the month of February. So you're not going to have a choice but to reflect on you. Okay? Every day it becomes easier to receive the highest divine plan and to trust my inner guidance. All right? What is Gemini needs to know as far as confessions of a soulmate? What do the person need to know, spirit? One card. One card. Communication. There's going to be some communication from someone new and then someone old, okay? I want to reach out to you. Please be open to receiving communication from me soon. Your response will encourage me greatly, and I will be waiting to hear back from you. So a lot of y'all could be hearing from someone new in your personals. Could be email, direct um, message, TikTok, Facebook, Instagram, uh, Twitter, uh, Clubhouse, whatever. And then someone from the past is going to come back because they're missing you. All right? The last message for my Gemini's in the month of February, Spirit. Show me clearly. Damn, Gina. Man, y'all Gemini's. Queen of Wands, replace your self-doubt with self-confidence, stepping into your power. Four of Wands, moving into stability. Four means karma. Everything, family, is whoever makes you feel the most safe and comfortable being you. All right. I release you, Gemini's, from me. Aquarius, this is for you. 17, 17 on the clock, my Aquarius, all right? This is your February reading. Let me move Gemini's out of the way. All right, my Aquarius. Eleven thirty-three can be significant to Aquarius. All right, two cards popped out. Aquarius, you do not have to go at it alone. You are worthy. You are worthy of everything. Stop thinking less of you. Stop thinking like, what did I do to deserve this? Stop putting a question on everything. Just accept it. Okay, in the month of February, you need to learn to start accepting stuff without questioning it. Okay, stop doing that. Okay, it is what it is because God says you're supposed to have this because you are worthy. Stop questioning everything. It's like you constantly in your head. That's why you're airhead. But come on, man, you got to come back down to reality. You got to start grounding in the month of February. Reach out for support in this time because you do not have to go at it alone. That's what your spiritual team is for. Okay, y'all have completed a cycle. 43 you could be 43 years old okay you could be life path number seven you are worthy once again you could be 44 is your life path number law and order okay karma you are worth up you are worth it all my love stop thinking that you're not worth it okay that's a slap in the face okay be open to receive stop over analyzing everything like what for why is this happening just accept it this is what spirit is saying in the month of february okay some people are meant to give you your roses while you're alive so appreciate your roses now that you can smell them and see them good luck is coming towards you aquarius in the month of february your fortune is improving and you will get a lucky break soon because you are worthy 
okay? Collect nuggets of wisdom. You will need them in the near future because you are worthy. They said be open to receive, all right? You're not doing this by yourself. Let other people help you as far as your spiritual team. What does my Aquarius need to know in the month of February, Spirit? One more for the for them, Spirit. We have scissors. <coughs> I mean, success. Okay, a lot of success. This is the good luck. Okay, money or property through an inheritance, winning a windfield because you are worthy. This is moving into your stability, okay? Candle, you will be shown the way. You do not have to do it alone. Spirit is going to show you the freaking way. You are not alone. So stop thinking that you got to do everything by yourself. No, you don't. It's because you want to. Because you don't like it when somebody else do it. You're like, that's not the way I want it, okay? So it's like you can't be picky. When you're picky a lot, you're missing out on your blessings, all right? So what else does my Aquarius need to know in the month of February? It's okay not to know everything, my Aquarius. This first thing I heard, it's okay not to know everything. No one's going to know everything. Seek someone to perform. Learn to do a hex-breaking ritual. Spirit is saying seek someone. That is not for all Aquarius. But Spirit is saying someone has done something to you. So you're going to have to seek someone that is can break black magic curses. Okay? Seek someone to perform learn a cord-cutting ritual. This learning to break a ritual. Okay? So Aquarius, you're going to have to seek out someone. Because someone is going to try to hurt you. And you cannot do it by yourself. You are, okay? You're going to have to let someone else do it for you. A lot of y'all need to be using Palo Santo more. This is a smooth, spicy aroma. Clears out negative energies. Relaxation fills your home with joy and harmony. Okay? Spirit is saying a lot of y'all is going to have to learn to depend on somebody. <laughs> y'all not built to help everybody. Y'all can't heal everybody. And sometimes you're not strong enough, weak enough to heal thyself because you're busy healing everybody else, okay? What does my Aquarius need to know in the month of February? Wanting. Whatever you wanting is wanting you, all right? You are not alone. You're worthy of what you're wanting. There's someone that's coming into your life. Like I said, a lot of y'all Aquarius, y'all sexual energy is going to be arising. So you're going to be attracting people from the past that's wanting to be with you and the people that's new, okay? I can't help wanting you sexually. Your energy excites me, allures me. I want your touch. I am craving for you. Your body turns me on. I just want you right now. Please come home, baby. Someone is wishing for you. Because your kudalini is arising. Okay. What else does my Aquarius need to know? Spirit show me clearly. Ease your mind. And the rest will follow. You got to get out of your head Aquarius. It's easy for me to receive. It's easy for me to receive. It's easy for me to receive because you are worthy. You got to start saying that, okay? You have divine abundance all around you. You were born to align with the love's will. Follow the Tao and start some serve something beyond the ego. Learn to be abundant, not chase it. Humility. Allow me, divine, to always accept the right assistance. I welcome your help in every way and delight in receiving it. You do not have to go it alone. Okay, non-duality. Let your authentic, authentic humanity shine forth while also bowing into the inner divine. You can become fluent at doing both because you are worthy. Outrageous openness. Dear love, open me to your will. Release me from my attachments. Surprise and delight me with your plan. 